A horrifying ordeal for several customers inside a West Side barbershop as a car crashes into the building, injuring five people. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm my Martinez. Jim Williams is off. Police are searching for the driver who ran from the scene. CBS 2's Audrina Bigas joins us live now from the North Austin neighborhood with the latest on this developing story. Audrina. Good evening, Mai. You can see this entire corner is still taped off tonight. And not only were people injured inside that barber shop, but the people who live upstairs are out of their home tonight, and they're being told that it's unsafe to go back in. Crews are boarding up the barber shop tonight. Inside, shattered glass, hair products, and parts of the wall all over the floor. At the corner of Waller and West North, they're trying to keep looters away and using these big beams trying to prevent the building from crumbling. How crazy is it that this happened right, un right underneath your apartment? Right underneath, and my son was sleeping, and he heard a boom, and everything is on the floor. 66-year-old Milagros Quinones is watching crews work from her van tonight. She's going to be out of the apartment. Till Tuesday. Till Tuesday, and I have nowhere to go. This is what caused all the commotion. Elmwood Park Police say the driver of this SUV was speeding and crashed into the barber shop. Witnesses say it was a police chase, but police have not confirmed that. Somebody ran straight through the window. The whole building shook, and then I heard people screaming. Everybody was trying to run towards the back. Two children and three adults inside the barber shop were hurt and taken to the hospital. A couple of the kids, they couldn't even walk there to take them out on the stretcher. Now, police are trying to track down the driver who ran away from the scene. People who live nearby and even some people who own these businesses next to us were wondering how those five people injured inside the barbershop are doing tonight. We did check, but we're still not clear um, what their condition is. Live in the North Austin neighborhood, Audrina Vegas, CBS 2 News. My thank you, Audrina.